what's up Disney Nuts here as you can see today we're at Animal Kingdom walking around checking out the holiday stuff here uh, this is the last park that I was missing actually to show the stuff so without further ado let's go inside the first thing we see is this massive beautiful tree here at the entrance of Animal Kingdom I think this is actually the only park that has the tree on the outside before we actually go into the turnout. The next thing you're going to see when you walk in is the Mary Menangini, which are these uh, puppet animals which uh, go around to around noon and it's a different set of animals every time you go by which is really cool and they interact with you. Really awesome experience. Very cool. <laughs> they get all these little animals on the top of the edge of the store. Very nice. Well, I don't think there's anybody performing. They have here uh, promoting the movie Disney Encanto. Now, as we walk into Dino Land, this uh, dinosaur actually here is really cool. I'm going to put some photos of how it looks at night. It actually changes colors which makes it really cool when you're walking in at night. I greet you with different colors and a smile. It used to be a uh, meet and greet here, now it's a pin trading station. But this guy's here, this big snowman. Now right across from the theater in the wild, which is where you used to do the Nemo show, you can come over here and watch Kite Tales. And I actually did a whole video of this, so I'm going to put a clip to it on the top. Now over there, which is the seating area for Kite Tales, if you actually come across to the other side of the theater, which is here, it's more like a resting zone. And she is actually not a bad spot for photos because they're actually, uh, the boats come out through one area, go around uh, the animal kiln and come out and come in through the same area they came out from. So I'm just parked here, I got my camera ready, take some good shots here and uh, adjust the waiting game and, and all the floats will come out eventually. Disney magic. Oh, 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 oh. A really cool decoration. 
put for the holidays here is in front of Feathered Friends here, which are these lanterns that you can see on the top, and they look amazing at nighttime. I'm actually gonna put a couple shots that I took so you can check them out, but here's how they look at day, uh, which they look really nice. Now another cool thing is that live entertainment is slowly starting to come back. Now as of all the holidays, we're going to head over here into the Flame Tree Barbecue and grab what is called the Menagerie Cupcake, which is what's being uh, featured here. So let's go ahead and do our mobile order and try it out. Okay, so here's what I ordered to, uh, just to give it a try. And here is the first one, which is the cupcake. And here is the second one, which is a drink. It's got these uh, little things here pretending to be ears. So let's go ahead and give it a try. It's not that. And when it comes to the drink, it was okay. It was a berry blast with um, some uh, Sprite to give it that kick into the drink. Uh, but what was the pineapple, was a, it was something, it was too chewy for me to be honest with you. It was a little weird and it didn't have too much flavor. It was more like a chewy uh, hard candy, if that makes any type of sense. And it didn't have the glow, uh, the glow cube inside, as it mentioned. Um, it was okay, something that I would order again, maybe. But as for the uh, cupcake, the melangerie cupcake, um, I don't know. It was uh, too much frosting on it, and then the those stars that it has on the top, they just broke up. It was like it wasn't uh, like chocolate or anything. It was just like stars, you know, like a sugary thing that just this moment you touched it, it would break all over the place. So you get it gets messy pretty quick. Okay guys, so that's it here from Animal Kingdom. Hopefully you enjoyed this uh, video of the holiday offerings. Now make sure also, if you can, to come back during the nighttime to see the Tree of Life projections, to see the Beacon of Magic as well, which is always a cool thing to see, which is where there's additional projections on the Tree of Life and stuff like that. So with that said, that's just enough signing out. Until then, stay awesome. See ya. Bye. <laughs> Oh, I'm so glad you hear that. Yeah. Yeah.